Hi friends. Today I am making this video to share with you all my love for composting and also to share the fact that Daily Dump uh, which is a company, a set of services that has been composting, providing composters and doing incredible work for the last 15 years. So they have stuck it up for 15 years which is amazing. So I want to congratulate them and also to take part in the celebrations I want to show you all my composting habit. So the star of today's show is this beautiful khamba. So this used to be a four tire khamba but now it's a three tire khamba because I broke one. But sorry for that. It still works really well. So there are three things that we need to compost. First is wet waste which you can see is absolutely anything that is left behind in the kitchen as we cook or finish eating and stuff. So you can see there's banana peels and eggplant and um, palak methi and eggshells. And as the saying goes, you are what you eat. So you can tell what I'm eating. And so you stir this, okay? This is the first ingredient, which is the wet waste. The second ingredient is brown matter. I am using cocoa peat. It's uh, in Marathi, it's called Narar Chishendi, but essentially coconut husks. We can also use dry leaves as brown matter. Sometimes you can also use uh, like pieces of paper that are brown, you know, like organic paper can also be used as brown matter. So these two things. And the third important thing is that it needs a little air to breathe, a little oxygen, a little sunshine, and it does wonders. So these are the two things. Now, just as we make yogurt and we put a little culture into milk so that it turns into curd, we need to use certain microbial cultures to start the process of composting. You can use buttermilk and jaggery, it works well. And Daily Dump also provides a set of microbes. So this is my first tile. The second tile is a lot more brown. You can, now you no longer see what the wet waste is. You just see that it's getting brown and it's getting slowly composted. And I'm just gonna show you the two because I want to show you the final product, which is the third one, which we have stored in this nice black pot. So this is extremely aromatic for once and black like gold. It smells of fresh rain, first rain when the soil gets wet and it's really nice. I can't like, I wish I could share with you how ecstatic I feel that all of the waste is finally turning into this wonderful manure. And as a token, I'm going to give this to this little pound that we have made here. So for now we have chili, methi. So I'm going to give this to the chili. If you see, we have some chilies as well. And we have methi, we have kale and beets and coriander and um, what else? There is ova, which is ajwain. And see, we have tomatoes too. The good thing is that it's not sticky. The compost, the manure is aromatic. It's wonderful. It does, it's like soil conditioning. It's what you do when you do face packs and hair packs to take care of yourself. This is what you do to take care of the soil. And it keeps everything in circulation. So basically, whatever is happening in, in the sense, what we waste in the kitchen is used to make manure put it back in the farm, use it to grow it, and then eat it. And therefore it's circular. So um, this is my composting habit and congratulations Daily Dump for finishing 15 years and thank you for um, making such wonderful composters, making it. This is also urban composting. It's not just that we have land here, but even in my Mumbai home, I have used these composters and they're extremely easy to use. So uh, I request you all to go check their page out and see what composting is and see if you like it. It's a lot of fun and it's, it's so, so fulfilling and satisfying. So thanks for watching.